Okay, so this has been old trusty for the past eight odd years. Never missed a beat. Um, updated the slicer and the software. And the old ANET A8 goes quite well. I always thought, what's the need to get another printer? Well, that was until such so time as we got ourselves a K1 Max. Straight out of the box. That's how it printed. 16 minutes for this benchy. And it is almost flawless. Poor old ANET takes 52 minutes to print. And that took 16. Extremely good. Quite surprising, straight out of the box. So the last 24 hours, we've been learning how to use it. Just printing up our uh, next part for our little venture. Um, here we go. So 300 by 300 by 300 printing size as opposed to 220 by 220 by 250 I think the old AMET does in height and this thing is fast I've actually slowed it down in the slicer um, compared to what it printed this bench yet I've never seen anything move so fast but anyway so that's our new edition the first new edition uh, for our research we're undertaking at the moment as you can see we've got parts all over the place a lot of test parts but um yeah it's like it's lifted a little bit or missed something right in the middle of that uh, first layer I don't know. see how it goes it's only a test bit so once we're done with it that then goes into the box of parts. Probably never to be used again. Very fast machine and the quality is very good. We're using Creality Hyper Series filament, which is no, no more expensive than uh, the standard stuff, so I might as well buy it. Alright, on with the research.